I recently learned that shag bark hickory nuts are edible, and not only are they edible, but that they're delicious. So I came out to my shag bark hickory tree, which is still pretty small. There's another one on the other side of the property that's a lot larger. And uh, it's late fall at this point, or mid fall rather, and now they're dropping all their, their nuts. And uh, you open up a husk like that, you know, pretty large compared to the nut, and inside is this nut. And then bring it inside, cracked one open with a pair of uh, vice grips. And it's actually delicious. And that was just raw. Apparently once they're roasted uh, or baked in cookies or bread, they're even better. But just raw, this is actually a really delicious nut. So if you have a shag bark hickory in your backyard, you know, instead of just brushing this stuff away, thinking it's just more lawn garbage, you know, crack them open. They're actually really good. Shag bark hickory trees are easy to identify because the bark peels off in sheets like you can see in this picture. The leaves grow in groups of five to seven, and they're large leaves, and in the fall they turn bright yellow. Before you spend any time cracking open any nuts, uh, first put them all in some water. Uh, the ones that float are no good. Take the ones that, that float and throw them away. Uh, the ones that sink, check them for any insect holes, make sure nothing's bored into them, uh, and then bring over the vice grips and start cracking. I also used a, uh, a bit of a gouge to help me pry the nut meat out of the shell because the shell is pretty intertwined with the meat so it's a little difficult to get out. After I got them out of the shell I threw them into the oven at about 250 degrees and ate a little piece of them every couple minutes till they tasted like I thought they should and then threw them on some brownies and they were delicious.